in the session of sustainable engineering MCN 201 it's module 5 lecture 1 um, myself Raul Anar assistant professor department of mechanical engineering SNIT today in this module we are going to discuss about the basic concepts of sustainable habitats this module is based on the uh, based on uh, sustainable habitat uh, green engineering and methods of uh, for uh, methods for efficiency efficiency in using sustainable methods and uh, sustainable urbanization sustainable transportations sustainable city etc this this is the summary of this this module and in this lecture we are going to discuss about the concept of sustainable habitat so sustainable habitat means sustainable habitat is an ecosystem that produce food and shelter for the peoples and other organism without resource depletion and in such a way that no external waste is produced sustainable habitat means an ecosystem which produce food and shelter for the human beings or living organism without affecting the resource depletion or the, the resources will not be depleted in such a way that no external waste is produced of sustainable habitat is the state of continuing a defined behavior for a long time is known as sustainability buildings their constructions operations and maintenance demands almost two-third of the global demand commercial and residential buildings accounts for more than 30 percentage of electricity consumption so this is the basic concept for sustainable habitat building and their constructions operations and maintenance demands uh, is the almost two-third of the global energy demand the commercial and residential buildings accounts for more than 30 percentage of electricity consumption for that a long behavior or long time of being in a continuous state is known as the sustainability we have to live for a long period of time in a stable or consistency manner so sustainability is required or sustainable habitats required promotion of energy sufficient buildings to minimize the energy footprints so we require energy sufficient buildings to minimize the energy footprints Um, the sustainable habitat is an ecosystem that produces the food and shelter for human beings and another or other organism without the resource depletion and external waste. As we told earlier itself in the definition, sustainable habitat is a is an ecosystem that produces food and shelter for human beings and other organisms without uh, without producing any external waste or without destroying the ecosystem or resource depletion. Uh, we are providing a of uh, providing food and shelter for the living organism a sustainable home is the one that environmentally friendly built from recycled materials and run on a renewable energy source so sustainable home means there are two types it is an it is an eco-friendly building or built home from uh, recycled material one element is recycled material and it is eco-friendly and second thing is it runs on renewable energy resources renewable energy resources and the home will run on renewable energy resources it may be evolved naturally or produced under human influences and intelligence it's a mimic of nature we can we can tell that the sustainable uh, sustainable habitat or sustainable home is a biomimicry of the nature it is natural it is like natural environment and will produce uh, under the influence and intelligence of humans it's, it's a replica of nature 
basic concept of the uh, sustainable engineering continuing uh, combined effort from environmental scientists and designers engineers architects for constructing a sustainable habitat a combined effort from the environmental scientists engineers designers architects are required for building or constructing a sustainable habitat many sustainable habitat use solar energy as a renewable resource in in alternate for the uh, for the hydropower plants or for uh, fossil fuels which will produce hot water and electricity for the homes landscape with native plants we will uh, make the landscapes or uh, gardens with the native plants goals of sustainable habitats while designing a sustainable habitat there should be two goals in your mind incorporate design concept that minimize the resource use maximize the energy and water efficiency eliminate exposure to the toxic environment etc identify ways and means such that the buildings and living can help protect the environment through practices that restore the nature sustainable habitat mission to 20 uh, it is the mission which it is introduced by the national government or in government in the central governments and the major uh, research and development program it is one of the eight climate change missions of india aim to make cities sustainable through improving in the energy efficiency in building management of solid waste shifting to public transport will broadly covers the following aspects extension of the energy conservation buildings code which addresses the design of new and large commercial buildings to optimize their energy demands better urbanization planning and model shift to the public transport it will make long term transport plans to facilitate the growth of the end of the medium and small cities in such a way that it that it ensures the efficiency and convenient public transport recycle of materials and urbanize urban manage uh, waste management it is a special area of focusing will be developed for developed of technologies for producing power from waste the national mission will include a major research and development program focusing on biochemical conversion wastewater use sewage utilization and recycling options wherever possible the national mission on sustainable have has been established with the following objectives the objectives of national mission on sustainable habitat as given below first one to reduce the energy demand by promoting alternate technologies and energy conservation practices in both residential and commercial areas second one better urban planning with a view to enable better disasters management promoting patterns of the urban planning that enables lesser use of private and more usage of public transport promoting and encouraging use of lesser polluting vehicles encouraging community involvement and dialogues for more sustainable times of in development and prioritization of task holders last one conservation of natural resources such as clean air water flora and fluids that that are that are the keystones of sustainable habitat okay this is the um, eight missions of missions developed by national response or national action on climate change first one is national solar mission enhance share of solar energy solar energy in energy mix to accelerate the deployment of technologies new and renewable resources second one is national missions on enhancing energy efficiency power enhancement energy efficiency in the industries through market based mechanism 
National uh, Mission on Sustainable Habitat, Responsible Ministries, Urban Development, Energy Efficiency in the Residential and Commercial Buildings, Public Transport, Solid Waste Management, National Water Mission, Water Resource Ministry, Water Conservation, River Basin Management, National Mission on Green, Green India, Environmental and Forest Ministry, Afforestation over Degraded Lands, Community Based Forests, Forest Protections. National Mission for Sustainable Agriculture, Agriculture Responsible Ministry is the uh, Drought Proofing, Risk Management, Agro Research. National Mission on Strategic Knowledge for Climate Change, Science and Technology Ministries, Valuable Assessment, Research and Data Management. Last one, eighth point is National Mission on Sustaining Himalayan Ecosystem, Science and Technology Ministries will do flourishing monitoring, conservation and adaptation practices in Himalayan ecosystems. So, silent features of Sustainable Habitat Mission 2020, extension of energy conservation buildings called ECBE, which provide minimum energy performance standards which address the designs of new and large commercial buildings to optimize energy demands, to focus on wastewater reuse and recycle option, to focus on conservation of water of biological or origins to biofuels that can substitute fossil fuels, to focus on proper municipal solid waste management. Silent features of sustainable habitat 2020 to better the process of urban planning and making public transport more efficient and convenient to focus on drinking water supply and management of exist water resources to focus on urban stone manage water management system Thank you.